All right, we're up early in the morning and we are headed to Barbuda. And we're excited. What time is it? It's 6.26. 6.26 a.m. Yeah, in Antigua, they have this really nice uh, kind of boardwalk area. They have a casino here and all kinds of shops and things to go see and do. So, yeah, we're really excited. Um, yeah, I, I'm hoping that the water's pretty steady, but it's a two-hour ferry from Antigua to Barbuda, so um, I don't know. I kind of feel like there probably is going to be some choppy parts, but we'll see. So we just got off of the ferry and that was a hard ferry ride for me. I, I think Jason enjoyed it, but if you sit up on the very top, the top level of the ferry, that's where all the action happens. it's the splash zone, you guys. It, it, I got so wet, like everything on me got wet. Everybody was wet on the upstairs part. Um, Jason went downstairs and left me and then I got so sick, you guys. I, I probably vomited eight times. It was... It was one of the hardest ferry rides that I've ever taken. Yeah, that water was really rough. It was pretty rough, yeah. And we have another ferry that we're taking, the same one, from Barpuda all the way back to Antigua uh, today in about six hours. So i um, going to do it again today as well. Uh, and then the Montserrat, we, we wanted to go to Montserrat too, but they discontinued the international uh, ferries right now. Um, um, they've discontinued the ferries to Montserrat. I believe this is just because they're international ferries and during COVID um, they had a lot of trouble obviously like continuing to do international ferries everywhere. So um, I, I think we're not we're not gonna do international um, ferries on this trip. We won't be going to Montserrat unfortunately but we'll do Barbuda which is gonna be fun. Um, I'm so excited for this. So today Jason and I, we're going up to a cave. We're going to go to the Pink Sands Beach. We're going to go get lunch at Nobu. I'm so excited for that, you guys. I cannot wait. Um, there's a private beach at Nobu, and they give you this, um, that basically they have showers, and it's like a, it's just a very nice, like, luxurious little break, um, which I'm looking forward to. And then, I don't know what else we're doing. Um, I think we're doing a couple other things today, but um, I'm super excited. I cannot wait. Right, guys we hitchhiked a ride over to Codrington and this is kind of what it looks like our host um, back in Antigua he said it was pretty dusty and flat and that's a pretty accurate description it is a little bit dusty here it's almost like a desert maybe um, but yeah it's very very flat I like it I like flat islands just so that you can see out into the distance so that's pretty nice um, but yeah I think we're gonna hitchhike a ride up to the very north so that we can go see a cave um, we're still go heading to go see that cave. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. This is an interesting place. I've, I haven't been to a place quite like this before. Wow, you guys, so we're already done walking across town. Um, the town takes maybe like five to ten minutes to walk through. It's definitely an interesting place. It kind of reminds me of a northern border town um, between Metzco and the United States, like north, yeah, north Metzcan border town. That's kind of what it looks like, just because it's so flat. Everything's kind of spaced out, very dusty. <laughs> and uh, we have these long, you know, long dirt roads. And uh, yeah, it's an interesting place. Kind of a cool place to go explore for a day. Oh, you guys, this reminds me of Arizona or like Mexico. There's donkeys and cactus. <laughs> Oh, I am too familiar with this landscape and background. Look how cute they are. There's a little baby. Okay, I'm gonna leave him alone. 
So right now I'm headed over to Nobu. Jason got stuck talking to some farmers up in the north. So he might join me, he might not. Either way, I'm excited because I want to go get some amazing sushi over at Nobu. Um, this is kind of what it looks like when you're driving up to the restaurant. Wasn't what I expected, to be honest, but um, I'm totally fine with it. I mean, it's a really pretty place. Um, very unique compared to anything else I've ever been to. And I'm just really excited to go here and try it. All right, guys, Jason finally made it over here. <laughs> I made it here. How were the ruins and the caves? Oh, the caves were not a big deal, but the ruins were really nice. They're really old. Did I miss out on a lot? Just the caves. Uh, no, 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 just the ruins. I think this is better. Yeah. <laughs> bananas in here. I'm not sure what this and this is. I think banana this is ice just cream. ice cream. Oh, yeah. it's banana ice cream? Yeah. Oh my gosh. And what's this? Do you know what this is? I don't know. Maybe caramel? This looks amazing. I'm so excited to try this. I'm so excited for this. How's that taste? This is so good. This is like a passion fruit. It's some kind of like it's like fruit. It's like a, few, a fruit puree. I don't know how to describe it. It's kind of tart, but it's really good. Huh. And then there's uh, bananas inside here. Right now. Nice. Yeah, fried. Yeah, fried. This is so good. You guys, their bathrooms are really nice. Super duper clean. And they have showers. So I'm gonna go snorkeling and get in the water because there's finally a place with a shower. I'm so excited. <laughs> Man, guys, so this was a really, really fantastic day. Yeah. That Nobu, 10 out of 10. That was 11 out of 10. It was, it was so nice. Um, the food was great. They had towels, showers. The beach was amazing. I used my new scor scor blah, 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 snorkeling gear. Um, yeah, everything was just really, really nice. Everything's been great. Yeah. And once you get past the first few dusty roads, everything in Barbuda around the south uh, end of the island is really, really nice. Um, and they have some really luxurious homes here, like 40, 50 million dollar uh, beach homes and things like that. So there's all kinds of stuff to see here. How did you like it, Jason? It was what do you great. give it out of 10? Out of 10? Yeah. Well, the island is really traditional. So you got the old rustic buildings and then you got the high end buildings. So it's good range. Yeah, it is. And there's no mountains here. So I like that too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was really nice. We're getting back onto the ferry. Yeah, I'm gonna go downstairs for this ride. Um, definitely not doing upstairs again. That was just a splish and splash yeah, you up even, there. It's further away from the center of gravity, so you're moving much more. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it was. Yeah. <laughs> but so let's cross our fingers. Two hours. <laughs> we're going back to Antigua. Um, and Antigua has over 300 beaches, so I'm really, really excited um, to go explore some of those as well. I think that's going to be really fun for Three, this next week. 365 beaches, one beach for every day of the year. I know. It's, it's amazing. <laughs> Picking the scales off of a fish. And then it, if you look in the water, you guys, there's a crab. There's fish everywhere. So cool. I guess this is a great destination for fishermen too.